Nantes, the surprise package of this Ligue 1 season so far, are beginning to slip through the gears. After an impressive 3 1 derby win over Rennes last time out, they welcomed Evian Tonongaya to La Bourgeois, looking to make it four wins on the bounce. Well, their coach, Michel Desikarian, spoke to the press this week and he said that it's important that his men keep their feet on the ground. Balance is key, and of course, intensity and concentration. Well, he will have been absolutely delighted with the way that the men in yellow started the game. Serge Gakpé crossing in for Filip Djordjevic with a barely two minutes on the clock. And the Serbian captain, who has been so strong, so impressive at Fort Nantes at the start of this season, making it five in just nine league and appearances. What a fantastic goal with one minute and 52 seconds. That was the quickest goal in Ligue 1 so far this season. Levian looked to get a grasp on the game. A first chance here for their serial goal scorer, Kevin Berrigo, trying to just work his way through the non defence there. But a comfortable save in the end for Remy Ryu, the non goalkeeper. And the visitors that simply couldn't handle the pace of the men in yellow. This time, Issa Sissoko getting forward, looking for a ball across. And there was Djordjevic. Perfectly positioned to make it 2-0 in the 34th minute. Evian at simply overrun. And the unfortunate Bertrand Lacke just pushing that one perfectly into the path of Djordjevic. Pascal Duprat no doubt will have had a few choice words for his men and in particular his defenders at the half-time break. Getting into the second half. But there was to be no fight back from Evian Tonangaya. And Nantes, in fact, made it 3-0 in the 65th minute. After a free kick was kicked out, it came back in through Luka Do, And there was a central defender, Papi Gilaboji, to claim his first ever goal in Ligue 1. A beautifully placed header there. As we can see, Gilaboji was onside, just getting the better of Lacke from the edge of the six-yard box. And the men in yellow just cruising to an easy win. A half chance here for Cedric Cambon. Not really threatening Remy Ryu or Michel Desikarian's men. So 3-0 the final score at the Beaujois. Things that couldn't be going better for the Canaries. They're up to fifth place. Well, Evian are now at two points above the danger zone.